Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Where are we going next? So today we're at the Barcelo Maya Caribe and we're here at the breakfast buffet to show you guys what it's all about. Later on we're going to check out the dinner buffet as well, so make sure you stay tuned for that. So this is continuing on our Barcelo Maya tour series here on YouTube. So make sure you're subscribed to see all the different videos coming out and check out some of the other videos we did here at the Barcelo. So we're going to start here at this uh, small cold cut station. So we have some uh, prosciutto, some tomato and onion, lots of nice stuff to start out your meal. We have some uh, small grapefruit and cheese and then some pork loin. Over here we have some more cheese and chicken. We have some peppers and broccoli, some guacamole, a nice fan favorite. Uh, we have some Italian zucchini, uh, boiled eggs that are halved here, some beets, lettuce and tomatoes. So yeah, lots, lots of nice healthy stuff here. Over here we have a big donut wall here. Lots of an assortment of different donuts as you can see. Lots of cool colors. I'd be a, definitely a fan favorite for the kids. Another option here for uh, kids is uh, some yogurts. They have some Yoplait in uh, bottles and regular yogurt containers. So we have some plain yogurt, strawberry, apple, looks like mango, uh, more strawberry. Looks like there's a cookies and cream yogurt. Oh my gosh, that looks delicious. A mixed berry. And then aside from that, or beside that, is some uh, different jello preparations in different colors. And if we uh, check out this station, we've got some peppers. So lots of different peppers. Uh, we looked at the um, Maya Beach um, breakfast. Also, they have these, and I gave the recommendation you might be able to take these back to your table and then just cut them up for your family. So that's a kind of a good little option if you get some whole vegetables. Just beside that, we have some cheeses like Swiss marble, vanilla, oh, um, poaca cheese, pepper jack, and provolone. And then on the back side of that, we have some whole fruit. So lots of healthy options here at this buffet. We've got some whole vegetables and whole fruit, some apples, peaches, bananas, a granola. And then over here, we have some yogurts. So we've got like, well, first we have some tangerines, banana with yogurt, cottage cheese, natural yogurt, peach yogurt, strawberry yogurt. And you can even kind of dress that up with some fruits, have like a fruit yogurt parfait, some guava, or sorry, some papaya, watermelon, apple, pineapple. We have some honeydew and cantaloupe. And then here we have like a honeycomb that will be dripping honey into this little bowl here. We've got some crepes and waffles in these little steam pots here. We've got some uh, lots of different like strawberry jam and some syrup. We've got some blueberries and peanut butter and chocolate sauce to go along with your waffles and crepes. Over here it looks like we have some like fruit carpaccios where we've got some very thinly sliced fruit and fruits and some fruit and vegetable sticks in the back. We've got some carrots, lime, apple, watermelon, or sorry, uh, not watermelon, but cantaloupe. We've got some fruit on a stick here, a mixed fruit salad, which looks really yummy. And then some more fruit on a stick. We've got some watermelon and some papaya. Over on this side, we've got some uh, cold cuts. We've got some smoked turkey ham, York ham. We've got some pork ham, salamis, some um, pork cheese, and some York ham here as well. And then uh, that does it for the inner side there. So we'll take a look at some of these options here. We've got some um, milk alternatives. Looks like we've got some like almond milk and soy milk. And then over here we've got some uh, packaged cereals. So like Corn Pops, Cocoa Krispies, Fruit Loops, Special K, All Brand. And then some chocolate and white milk to go along with that. And then over on this side across from the uh, cold salads we saw earlier we have some fresh sandwiches which you can use this like press right here to make like, a nice fresh sandwich. Here we've got some uh, bagels, smoked salmon, and some cream cheese to go along with that. And then finally, um, there's gonna be another station just over here, but it's gonna be the exact same as what I'm seeing here. So I'll just go through this spot once, wrap around this way and show you from the beginning here. We've got some, so some uh, sweet bread, oh, it looks like more sweet breads, not cookies. Some cinnamon buns, and then some sugar uh, croissants, some regular croissants dinner rolls, looks like some dinner rolls with cheese on them. And we've got some bread here with lots of different like jellies and peanut butters, butter, and you can toast them in these little toasters here to get some toast. Again, this is all located on the other side behind me, kind of on a, a mirrored of this uh, little walkway we're on right now. 
there's some sweet cakes, there's some muffins, and some more like sweet breads and loaves. Here we have some Mexican coffee, and we saw this in some of the other buffets that they have these like authentic Mexican uh, mugs to get like a nice authentic Mexican coffee experience here in the morning. If you prefer like more uh, traditional coffee, you can get uh, coffee mugs there and get any kind of coffee uh, style here. This one uh, that kind of looks like hard to see is espresso and this one's mochaccino. Okay, so heading down this way, we're gonna look at some more hot foods now. Over here we have some hot oatmeal and some hot chocolate with some bowls to go along with that. Just beside that we have some, uh, some bacon, we have some uh, sausage, some potato hash browns and some breakfast sausages. White beans, uh, looks like another like kind of like a dried sausage more back there, it doesn't have a name on it. And then we have some chilaquiles with red sauce and green sauce so you can choose your heat level appropriately. Scrambled eggs and mashed potato. And then just to the left of, or just to the right of that, we have some uh, toppings to go in an omelette. So you can choose anything here, and they'll make you a fresh omelette just at the station here. So we've got some onion, ham, tomato, spinach, mushroom, and then some uh, different sauces here: cheese, pico de gallo, and red and green sauce. And then just down from that, we have some uh, empanadas, some rice. Looks like a pork stew, um, Yucatan-style pork in the back. Uh, some refried beans and some potato with sausage and I'm just reading the uh, the writing up here as like a little cheat sheet here as you can see a lot of it is described here so again like there's chicken right here uh, poblano pepper strips beef stew and some cactus with bell pepper and then just down from that we have some special desserts that are located down here and it looks like we have some churros and some Mexican style sweet bread. So we're gonna head down this area. This is the kids area, because you can see that the buffet is kind of lowered. So kids can grab some stuff, like some sandwiches. Looks like there's some like uh, crepes with chocolate toss. There's some gummy bears, that's so cute. We saw that in some other buffets. Some small desserts and then some pasta salad. Here's some guava and honey pancakes, potato wedges. We have some pasta and then some uh, nice little uh, puff pastries with like nice icing designs on top. Looks great. I like that they have this like kids area here that's lowered down. Easy for kids to grab. In the middle here towards the back of the buffet, we have like a beverage station which can be served yourself or this is where most of the workers will come and grab you a drink if you order from your table. So it looks like there's like a self-serve mimosa station. Awesome for celebrating in the morning. We have some soft drinks here. Give you a little shot of those so you can see what's offered. Looks like at the resort they have Pepsi and uh, not Coke products. There's some Modelo on tap. And then we have some uh, juices here. We have like a tangerine juice. We have pineapple juice, orange juice, and apple juice. And then some fresh squeezed juices like watermelon, green juice, pineapple, cantaloupe, and papaya juice. So these are like nicely fresh and squeezed for a good healthy alternative in the morning. And over here we have a very similar to what we saw in the previous hot station, like the hot chocolate and hot oatmeal. A couple different options here. Looks like we have some turkey ham or turkey bacon, some molletes, Argentine style sausage right here, some rice with peas and corn, more beans, some chorizo sausage back there, traditional style scrambled eggs, boiled eggs, and we have some chilaquiles here, green sauce and red sauce like we saw before. Another omelette station that's not being used at the moment. Hello! <laughs> and then all the toppings that we saw that go along with the omelette here. Just across from that omelette station, it's another kids corner here and they have, or it's an exact image of what we saw earlier here, another kids corner. And again, just to spread people out a bit so everyone's not bunched up together. Down here we have some white beans, we have some onion, tomato, some um, steamed vegetables, carrots and cauliflower, some lentils, a nice little option here for some fiber, We've got some corn, cactus with pork again here, We've got some pork with red sauce, cabbage with bacon, and some vegetable quiches here. They look really nice. I think they're in a red sauce, so they might be a little spicy though. And then if here's the dining room. If you prefer to sit outside, there's a beautiful terrace out here you can see that's like covered with like uh, nice little pergolas like you see at the pool. And uh, with that, we're gonna turn things over to uh, dinner time to take a look at some of the offerings at dinner. So we're back at the Barcelo Mayacaribe buffet for dinner time. So we're gonna take a look at some of the offerings here at dinner time, starting with this beautiful station to welcome you in. 
They've got some different uh, like baguettes and uh, bread offerings and such here, but just like beautiful presentation to start things off here. Really like that. So if we wrap around this side, we're gonna start off with some um, cold meats. So we got some salami, we got some turkey ham, some uh, pork cheese. Looks like we've got some um, black olives and olives here. Got some pastrami, and then York ham and some Calabrese salami here. Over here we got some salmon, some roast beef, a Calabrese salad, and then some prosciutto. And I really love the presentation on the back here with these vegetables and fruit. Okay, over on this side we've got a, a seafood cocktail. It looks like uh, basically shrimp with seafood cocktail sauce. We've got a, uh, some pineapple salad, mussels. We've got a lemon cocktail and uh, shrimps here. Here we've got a pasta salad with uh, quinch, a spinach salad with uh, fruit, couscous, and then we have a ham salad and a fish tuna salad. Okay, in the next island here, we've got our fresh vegetable market, just like we saw at breakfast time. And wrapping around, we've got some um, fixings to make a nice cold salad here. We've got some onion and tomato, peas and corn, some red onion and cucumber, some tuna in the back, with some radish, some beets, and some green bell pepper. And then just to kind of break up the salad here, we've got some desserts here on the end cap. So there's no tags, but you can see these are kind of like a strawberry. These are like cakes, nice chocolate cake here. These are untouched, nobody's had dessert yet. And then some uh, like puff pastries with strawberry and chocolate brownies. On this side, we've got some uh, greens to make your salad up. And then some dressings to go along with that as well, just on the bottom here. It's always a little bit of an adventure, kind of like choosing a dressing when they don't have name tags either. But uh, thankfully these do, they have like a ranch dressing here, vinaigrette, and then they have a Aurora dressing here on this one. Okay, so just looking over this way, we can take a peek and see the bread station. So all kinds of different dinner rolls to accompany your plate. There's even some white bread and brown bread to toast up if you're looking for some toasted bread. And then over here we've got some like sugary treats. We've got some sweet breads and some sugar croissants and chocolate croissants. We've got some nice donuts here all throughout. Oh, we've got some nice cinnamon rolls, yummy. Just across from that, we've got our fruit station. So here we've got some uh, grapefruit, oranges, we've got some honeydew, uh, cantaloupe on this. We've got some dragon fruit, strawberries, kiwi. These are great. I love how these are arranged. We've got some mango and watermelon there. This is excellent. On this, uh, we've got some pears, pineapple, watermelon. We've got dragon fruit, mango, peach. Nice, beautiful presentation again. And then in these uh, hot trays here we've got some different assorted pastas and over on this side we've got a few more desserts similar to the ones we saw earlier so we've got a cheesecake we've got a flan a strawberry cake and a brownie here a nut cake vanilla roll mocha cake and then a fruit cake here and i've just come up onto another island here we we're just over there touring that kind of cake area and i've just come over here to show you this uh, cheese arrangement Beautiful presentation. They're doing such a good job at Barcelo with presenting all the food here. These are all kinds of different cheeses. Again, the name plates are here, but like just such an assortment of cheese. And I can't wait to show you guys this. Look at this watermelon someone carved. That is so cool. How creative. And then just down from the cheeses, we have some candies. We have some jelly beans, some like little star candies. We've got some jelly, uh, jelly, oh, sorry, some gummy bears. Yeah, this is awesome. You can like get some ice cream and then just uh, put together a nice little uh, candy dessert. This is great for kids. And then turning over this way towards the back, there's going to be separated into two different areas over here and here. So we'll go down to the left first and we'll take a peek at some of the soup offerings. So here we have a minestrone and a zucchini soup today in these uh, big, crock or big pots here. Here we have a roast beef all cut up, ready to go. We've got some roasted chicken. A nice like uh, pasta in the back. Got some lasagna. Got some uh, duck stew, a beef style stew in the back, and then some lasagna, which has already been picked over, and it's only 20 minutes into dinner. And then we have a fish in the back too. Moving over this way, we've got all the different sauces to top up your meal: red sauce, spicy tomato sauce. We got our green sauce, typical that we've seen at the different buffets here. And then we have some cooked tuna some uh, cooked fish, some steamed vegetables and beets, 
a chickpea salad. We have some polenta on the back. And then beside that we have some um, rice with mushroom, some potato, sweet potato, baked, a lentil stew, and then some roasted potatoes. And beside that some eggplant with zucchini and some beans, a bean stew. This looks like more like a white bean stew compared to the uh, other one we saw earlier. So across from this station, just over here, we've got a uh, kids area, just like we saw at breakfast. And on the kids area, we have some uh, desserts here. We've got like a little fruit cup and a chocolate dessert. Some additional desserts here. These aren't named at all, so I can't really tell you what these are without tasting them. And then over here, we've got like a calzone. Looks nice. Some chicken wings in the back. A bow tie pasta with tomatoes. Um, some small little um, sandwiches here. Fruit compote, looks like uh, apples I believe, and then some samosas in the back. So a nice little uh, kids corner here for dinner. Okay, so over on the right side in the back wall, we have the soups again over here. So just two more pots of soup. And then we have a uh, lamb leg. So instead of the beef leg, we got a lamb leg now with beautiful presentation. Some gravy to go along with that. And then here we have some lasagna. We've got some shrimps, pasta with seafood, uh, mahi mahi fish lasagna with vegetables, we've got a salmon, some scallops, and then another fish here, Veracruz style, uh, squid rings and some mussels. And then here we've got like a uh, grill here that's active at the moment that can cook any of these wonderful fresh meats or vegetables. So we've got some like fresh chicken, eggplant, um, Argentine um, chorizo, carrots, we've got some smoked lamb chops, we've got like a New York steak right here. We've got some more pork, more chicken, more chorizo. So they'll take any of this stuff that you choose and cook it fresh on one of the grills here. And they've already got some stuff here cooked if you'd like to quickly grab something and you don't want to wait. And then over here to finish off, we've got some um, different stews here. A beef stew, roasted chicken in the back. We've got a Mexican zucchini and then a bean stew. Roasted chicken. This is cactus with onion. I keep seeing cactus and I've never tried it yet. I gotta get some, maybe tonight. Some um, traditional white rice and then some pork stew here. And then in the back here, we've got a uh, pizza station. So we've got uh, some different offerings. We've got like pepperoni, we've got some uh, onion, vegetable pizza, and they cook it in this beautiful wood-fired stove here, which is uh, the fire's roaring in the back, ready to make some pizzas tonight. So with this beautiful pizza oven, that's gonna do it then for our video tour of the buffets here at Barcelo Maya Caribe. Hope you guys enjoyed that. If you found that helpful, seeing some of the food offerings here at the hotel, give our video a like, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel to find out where we're going next.